Gamers! We're back. So today I'm back with a brand new video. Today I'm gonna to be going over the high pitch vocal effect that a lot of these motherfuckers use in like hyper pop, but it's also starting to creep its way into normal songs like Mr. Rage. And I feel like it's gonna become a lot more popular. So I figured I may as well cover it now. There's tons of different ways to do this, but I mean, in my opinion, this is the most fun. And for me, the easiest way to do it. It's real simple, real easy. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it right freaking now. But before we do that, I'm gonna ask y'all hit the like button subscribe why not we're uh we're on the way to 2k i'm uploading every day by the time this video is up uh we should be at 1.8k so thank you guys so much for that you guys are awesome <laughs> so first thing you're gonna want to do go into your fl studio of course and um let's just drag in a quick little hyper pop beat okay so we got our beat let's play it here's the drop <laughs> it's hard i fuck with it but we need to put it on beat so 164, that looks about right. The drop is right there. Let's try and hear it. Perfect. That's all we got here. We're good to go. And then the next thing is we're gonna open up one of our presets. We're gonna be using my Glaive preset for this one. So you don't need to use my preset, but I highly recommend using it because it'll, it'll speak for itself. Just in case you guys do download it, I'll show you guys how to open it. It's really easy. So all you really have to do is right click on the track, go to file, open mixer track state. We're gonna go to our Glaive preset right here. It comes with two. We're just gonna use the main one for today. Click on it and boom, it's right here. So that's really all you have to do. So just in case you do download it, that's all you gotta do. If you do wanna download it, link in the description. Once again, it's the Glaive preset. Here's the little picture of it one more time. But anyway, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our Auto-Tune and I'll show you how to do this in both Auto-Tune EFX and in Auto-Tune Evo. Pretty much the same way in both, but it looks different on how to do it. So I'll show both ways. So you're gonna wanna hear yourself with the Auto-Tune live. So it's really easy to do. All you have to do is go to this none icon, click on it, go to in one or whatever your microphone is, mine's in one. And now we're on auto-tune. Really easy, really, really simple. Easy. So the first step you're gonna wanna do, go over to your auto-tune. And uh, if you're on EFX, go down to Interaz, go to pitch and throw. And I suggest doing third up childify. You just click that. So now we sound like this, but nah, nah, nah. If we try and sing higher, it'll do like way higher notes. This won't be in the key of our beat anymore. So we kinda have to find it just by toying around, you know, just play the beat, hum and try and find it. So you can actually do minor or major. I'm gonna do major, so. You say that you with me, okay? I got different time, mm, 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 mm. I got all these drugs, yeah, I don't wanna take. It's really fun to just fuck her out with. You can make a lot of cool shit with it. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it with Autotune Evo now. Here it is. And then we're gonna go to Transpose. And then we just move this up three. And then we just try and find it again. It might be different. Okay, we found it. So it's, this one's F sharp major. So you're gonna have to play around with the keys. But, I mean, it's the same shit, really. It's just different layout. So, move the transpose up. You can play with the throw as well, so it's like, ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. But anyways, really easy effect to do. Once again, if you want this preset, it's the Glaive preset. I know you guys can probably barely hear me, but anyways, link in the description, logo.com. Come fuck with it. I'll see ya.